Here in the heart of the Sulu Sea, we find one of the most beautiful seascapes in the world, Tubataha Reef's Natural Park. This marine protected area spans almost 100,000 hectares of rich habitats teeming with a great diversity of marine life, including 13 species of whales and dolphins, 13 species of sharks, and hawksbill and green sea turtles. Such breathtaking beauty has earned Tubataha its reputation as one of the most remarkable coral reefs on the planet and one of the best dive sites. Located some 90 nautical miles southeast of the Palawan capital, Puerto Princesa, the park is accessible through a 10 to 14 hour boat ride. It is under the political jurisdiction of Cagayancillo, a municipality some 60 nautical miles northeast. Rough sea conditions prevail for most of the year, but from mid-March to mid-June, seas are generally calm and winds are fair, ushering in the scuba diving and research season. Hundreds of divers on liveaboards visit the atolls to behold one of the greatest spectacles of nature, an underwater paradise in the cradle of the most diverse coral reef ecosystem in the world. Colossal barrel sponges and extensive vibrant fan corals drape the steep walls that captivate Tubataha divers. Brisk currents animate marine life into dazzling colors and movements. Among them, more than 600 species of fish. The abundance of fish is intertwined with the diverse coral clusters that dot the Tubataha reefs. Over 70% of all coral families on the planet are found here. This jewel of the sea is also a haven to one of the few remaining colonies of breeding seabirds in the region. Six seabird species, hardly found anywhere else in the Philippines, breed in the islets. And after years of egg collection and hunting, their population has finally stabilized. Tubataha's legacy goes far beyond beauty. It plays a vital role in creating and sustaining life in this underwater paradise and beyond. The wealth of wildlife here is an indicator of ecological balance, seen in the healthy reefs and sufficient food that make it possible for so much life to thrive. Almost 200 species of marine life, including corals, fish, and marine mammals in Tubataha, internationally listed as threatened, find refuge in this no-take zone. Tubataha serves as a nursery for fish and coral larvae that move about to neighboring fishing grounds. Oceanographers have discovered that prevailing winds and currents transport these particles of life throughout the Sulu Sea and beyond. The constant flux of larvae is the lifeblood that contributes to the food security of the Philippines, where more than 60% of the population depend on fisheries for food and livelihood. But this magnificent legacy is shadowed by many threats. Intensifying maritime activities and marine pollution leave scars on this critical seascape permanent scars should the impacts of these activities go unabated. Ships' groundings have repeatedly marred this underwater gem. Illegal fishing, although mostly abated, is an ever-present threat, as fisheries productivity elsewhere continues to dwindle. Preserving Tubataha's beauty and richness requires collective effort from the public and private sector. Help preserve this beautiful jewel of the sea for generations to come. Support conservation efforts. Learn more about our oceans and take action to protect them by following environmental regulations and minimizing our impacts on the earth as much as possible. Encourage others to do the same. Our action or inaction counts. The time to act is now.